New York. Well, this morning we get to meet a 14-year-old who's using his passion for cooking to make a difference in the lives of children fighting cancer. I'm talking about Josh Small, who's been cooking since he was very young, but during the pandemic got the chance to spend more time in the kitchen and decided to use his food to help raise money for Ronald McDonald House, New York. Josh joins me now along with Maniva Ahmed, the Marketing Communications Coordinator at Ronald McDonald House. Welcome. Thank you for having us. Yes, yeah, very welcome. All right, so Maniba, for those who don't know, tell us about Ronald McDonald House and also about the patient who only wanted to eat croissants during a cancer treatment. Yeah, absolutely. So Ronald McDonald House, New York, we provide critical care and support services to families who are battling pediatric cancer and other serious illnesses. Um, we do that through our physical house on East 73rd Street in Manhattan and through partnering hospitals in New York City. Families who are facing a diagnosis of a serious pediatric illness are facing unimaginable strain. It can cause a toll on them physically, mentally, emotionally, financially, and that's where our support services come in. We are here to help families ease the burden a little bit and help provide them with access to transportation, housing, programs, support services. Um, in 2022, we had a family staying with us from Michigan. Um, their child was receiving treatment for pediatric cancer, and unfortunately, the child lost their appetite mm. until they tried croissants and sandwiches from Chez La Frenchie's, which is a local Upper East Side restaurant. Um, after hearing that wonderful story, Michelle and Oksana, who are owners of the restaurant, decided to fundraise for the house, and that's where they looped in Josh for his amazing cooking skills. And uh, yeah, Josh, how did you get involved? So, good question. I've known Michelle and Oksana from the Frenchies, from Shirley Frenchies Cafe mm -hmm. on the Upper East Side next to my school for quite a few years now, and you know, they know my passion for cooking is pretty big, and when I started cooking more professionally because I started running a catering business in the Catskills named Josh Kid Caterer. They really got interested and they actually, you know, they knew I was so serious about it. So contacted me after this postcard <laughs> from the family in Michigan, like Muniba just said, um, and really wanted to give back to Ronald McDonald House. So we planned this fundraiser where I would cook, they would sell the food, and then for a week, all of the proceeds from this would go to Ronald McDonald wow. House. Wow. Okay, Josh, what did you cook for the fundraiser and how much money did you make? So this was a two-year project. So it was a week each year. Mm -hmm. First year, I cooked my signature lasagna, which is... I love lasagna, by the way. Okay, so oh, we're going to have to meet up later. I love it. Okay. Which is a, <laughs> a mix of beef and pork with a bunch of different veggies, you know, with fresh homemade pasta. I also made cold soups both years that I'm currently selling in stores in the Catskills. Year two, I also, so I remade the soups and remade the lasagna, and I also made a, veg a vegetable curry, which was, you know, which had plenty of local, fresh, crisp veggies uh, that were in season mm -hmm. at the time. And how much money did you make with the fundraiser? So combined both years, so the combined total for both years was $2,100. Wow, congratulations. And and thank you both for the work that you do. I love Ronald McDonald House. I've done many stories there, and it's it's incredible what you do for the families. And Josh, lasagna? Yeah. <laughs> yes. Okay, yay! All right. Thanks so much, uh, both of you, for your time this morning and all the work that you are doing and continue to do. To learn more about Ronald McDonald House New York, we have a link on our website, cbsnewyork.com. We'll